Junior alerted his owner to a fire that was burning up the house. Oh, Junior was barking all nonstop. He made his way through the thick black smoke to wake up the rest of the family, eight people. Just out of nowhere, he jumped. And that has never happened before. Found out that I was having a massive heart attack. Richard and his wife Carrie adopted Chong from a Chihuahua rescue group. Do you need police or paramedics? That whimpering is coming from Buddy. Buddy's owner had suffered a seizure. But he always looks out for me. His man's best friend doesn't go far enough to describe Buddy. Yeah, he saved my life. If it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be here. He heard Max barking. The home was pitch black and he felt the heat. He was my wife's dog and I really didn't care for him that much, but I think he's my new buddy now. So. Yeah, this recent cold weather almost claimed the life of a Toledo woman, but she says her dog saved her. Sam tells us she finally was able to call out Maddie's name. And she just put her back under my belly like, and she kept lifting. Sam says this 104-pound golden retriever carried her on her back, dragging Sam to her bed inside. If it wasn't for Maddie's rescue, I'd have been froze. Sam says fire flares up, filling a home with smoke. Man's best friend helped save the man's life. There was one man at home. He was sleeping at the time, but he was awakened by his dog. In Malta, New York, the home of Ernie and Marion Coons burns. We woke up to uh, our dog making a noise. It was the Coons' dog, Cindy, a dog they had had only a couple of months. Their dog uh, woke them. But Cindy the companion, Cindy the hero dog, never made it out of this home. Darren Weeks says if not for his dog, Roscoe, he wouldn't be alive to tell his story. The fire erupted next door in this duplex. I pulled him out of the house and he kept trying to go back in. It was an Australian shepherd named Tally and a Springer Spaniel named Gibson that forced their owner to wake up and, and might have been there even longer if not for Max. But Fitzsimmons was rescued, and ironically, so was Max from an animal shelter. Gina somehow managed to drag or carry the newborn over near her own pups, and when a neighbor of the human persuasion heard the baby's cries, they went to investigate. Now locals call him the miracle baby and Gina a hero.